Welcome back folks, this is Pat Danis here at Ritter's Garden and Gift and today we want to talk about bugs and slugs. Slugs are coming, this is something I actually used to live on the west coast over in Seattle and we actually used to ship these over to you guys and it seems to do very well because they're attacking your garden center. No, just kidding. Good way to control these you guys is with bug and slug. This is actually all natural, it's iron phosphate and spinosad. Okay, what you do with this product is, is it's actually an attractant. We put wheat germ in it to get it to attract the bug to it. So you don't want to put it in your vegetable garden or in your plants. Put it around the outside edge of it. The slugs and snails were actually in the bugs will come out to eat it. And they actually pick up the insecticide. And with slugs and snails, it actually closes off their feeding mechanism. Therefore, they just go back underneath the bark. They go back underneath your plants. And they just go back to being part of your natural soil, okay? You don't have to worry about picking them up like you do with some of the harmful synthetic chemicals. It actually is just a natural process that works very well. The spinosad in it is what works on earwigs, cutworms, any of the little insects you've got that chews onto your plants. They actually pick the insecticide up and it almost does the same thing to them. They just quit feeding and eventually they go back to dust to dust, ashes to ashes, back into your garden area, okay? But remember, don't put it into your garden because again, it's an attractant and the last thing you want them to do is eating their way in to get to the product. So remember on the outside, they make it two different sizes, depending on how big a job you've got, and it covers a lot of square feet. This one will do about 2,000 square feet. Now the key thing to remember, don't make piles. Piles will attract your pets. Just sprinkle it out there. When it's time to reapply is when you don't see any more pellets. They are waterproof, and you'll know when they're all gone, that's when it's time to reapply. 